dad, Mr. Neville, here today, and so he's going to help me with this trick. So for this trick, what you're going to need is, I would recommend having a leash if you're working outside, which is what we are doing, your clicker, um, which you don't have to use, um, high value treats, and then also like a mat. I want to show you this because it's super cute. Um, thanks, buddy. So this is our, this is our mat, our dog mat. Where are This is our dog mat. Isn't that adorable? All right. So the goal for this trick is having you send your dog from a distance to this mat or place. All right, so we are going to start this trick for you. So first of all, I am going to, um, we're gonna lose our clicker for a little bit today. Cause I want, he's so clicker crazy, I want it to be nice and calm. So I'm going to take the leash and I'm going to lure him onto the mat um, and I'm going to treat him. He could be in a down, he could be in a sit. Take whatever so that they know that once I put my four paws on this mat, I get a cookie and that sounds pretty nice to me. So I'm just gonna sit here and I'm gonna feed him. This is step one. Good job, good job. Now I'm gonna put him in a down, so down, down, come, double down. He's sneezing, come here, down. put him in a down. Down. I'm going to feed him in that down. So I'm going to get some stays here. So stay. Good. I'm going to use the word good instead of yes because I uh, uh, use yes as also a release word. with this trick and not only do I want him to put the four paws on the mat, I also want him in the down. Okay, come! Good job! Good job, ready? Ready? Almost there. Yes! Good job! Good boy! Good boy! Good boy! Good boy! Good job! Good job! Already in? And I can also um, use distance and duration. Um, so, for example, I'm going to put Neville down on the mat again. Neville down. And say stay. And have him stay there as well. Okay, Clee! Good job! Ready? And place. So this is mat work or place work, and it is an intermediate trick. And I want to see your videos and see how you guys are doing, and we'll see you soon. All right, happy trick training. Bye. Hey, everybody. So I know that was kind of like a crash course into mat training or uh, place training, but I wanted to let you know, because I wanted to work Neville, that's why I wanted to do it. Because <laughs> he knows a little bit of mat training, so I wanted to work with him and get him out there, because he, we're working on those tricks, so let's just say that one. Um, so, because I usually work with Luna. So I wanted to give you some more information about the mat training, um, and place training. And this trick can be found in the 10 minute dog training games 
my Curious Sundance with Doomer with your dog, and I highly recommend getting in because this is an awesome book. Um, if you just have 10 minutes a day, you know, get out there, do more with your dog, and have a lot of fun. So this trick is actually found, Target Man is on page 132, and this is what it looks like, super cute. So for this trick, they actually use, um, like a smaller disc shape item, and they can also use over here, there's, you can start with the pedestal, um, as a small, um, mark to go to. So this trick is actually used quite a lot in agility, as far as teaching the dog when to stop at a certain point, when to say halt. Um, so going to your mark is actually a really good thing to do. And I recommend practicing while you're doing the dishes. If you have a little sort of a rug or a mat or a place, um, practice while you're doing the dishes. So have a cup of treats waiting for you while you're doing the dishes and send your dog back and forth to the mark. Um, and say good and treat them on that place because we always want to treat when in the position that they're in. That's right. Okay, so I just want to give you um, a little tutorial uh, after we um, we showed the trick. Um, so, because we wanted to be outside today and it's gorgeous out. People are mowing their lawns. The trains are going back and forth, and my dad is grilling. So that's why another thing that I got distracted with. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this book. Um, Ten minute dog training games, super fun, uh, super quick. Um, if you're like me, who needs to work on her graduate student homework right about now, um, <laughs> that's what I need to do. Uh, so we did our 10 minutes today, uh, do 10 minutes every day, and that was place training and mat training and pedestal training, so going to your mark. So happy trick training, and we'll see you soon. All right, bye!